and a good Friday afternoon and evening. Filling in for David Glenn tonight because David is up in the Smoky Mountains hiking with his son. He sent some of these pictures and posted them. And oh my goodness, you can see the colors that are changing. And of course, this picture does not do it justice. This is going to be a great weekend to get out there because near peak and the highest of elevations here close to home. It's still partial in the valleys, but that's going to change with the cool air that is in place. And of course, up in the Smokies, we're talking peak and maybe even past peak as we get into next week. If you take a photograph, let us know. You can go to our website, newschannel9.com, and submit those photographs to our Chime In tab. Make sure you do include your name and location, and I want to show a picture every day next week. This is really going to get the leaves changing here. Frost advisories, even some freeze warnings to the east of us. In the middle here, Chattanooga, Cleveland, Dalton, we do not have any advisories because the frost may not be as widespread. But nevertheless, I do expect some patchy frost for many of us tomorrow morning. High pressure building in today. That's what's caused these winds to come out of the north and east. A chilly day where highs were only in the 50s and 60s as expected. But we do begin to warm up heading into next week. Tomorrow will kind of be an in-between day. I think we're back in the mid-60s, but not as windy after that cool and frosty start. But some 70s and even some 80s returning as we head into next week. Goodness, but that's really not unheard of for October, as normally we do go up and down. So temperatures going down tonight, 52 degrees here by 9, into the 30s by tomorrow morning. I think everybody will be in the 30s. I know you see some 40s here as some warmer air appears to try to move into the higher elevations, but I've got my doubts there. I think all of us will be in the 30s, and I would not be surprised some typical cool spots are in the low 30s. Wow. All right, here's your future track on Saturday, sunshine. Most of us will be in the low to mid 60s. And then we get into your Sunday 40s in the morning. So a little bit warmer and around 70 by the afternoon. The latest from the Climate Prediction Center does suggest average temperatures to wrap up pretty much the month of October. No real big cool downs, but there could be one towards the end of the month. We'll watch it as we get towards Halloween. I don't see a whole lot of rain either, but there is some suggestion of rain coming Really not anytime soon, but maybe next weekend. There's Saturday, Sunday, Monday, a front passes through. Uh, it's not really going to do anything. We get into Wednesday and Thursday, we warm up. So let's go right into Friday, and there's our next chance of seeing some showers as we head into Friday afternoon. Otherwise, temperatures are really going to start to warm up. We're back in the mid-70s on Monday. We're back in the upper 70s on Tuesday. And like I said, upper 70s and maybe some low 80s heading into Wednesday and Thursday. Seven-day forecast looking mighty fine over the weekend. Mentioning it, a little cool tomorrow, but around 70s Sunday, 70s Monday and Tuesday. And look at those 80s on Wednesday and Thursday. It certainly is a possibility. You have yourself a wonderful weekend.